Understanding cues and implementing planning care are essential qualities as a nurse. Nurse Joey is assigned to care for a post-operative male client who has diabetes mellitus. During the assessment interview, the client reports that he's impotent and says he's concerned about his its effect on his marriage. In planning his clients in this client's care, in planning this client's care, the most appropriate intervention would be to. So when we paraphrase this, we have a post-op diabetes client who has concerns about impotence. What is the most appropriate intervention? So the most appropriate intervention is what you're looking for. Remember, I encourage you, no matter who you're doing questions with, to have a sheet of paper and pencil or something to write with to, to basically weed out what your distraction, what your, your keywords are. So get those keywords and you're weeding out those distractions. And then um, as you select your answer, then you are writing down your rationale. So as the most appropriate intervention, are you going to encourage the client to ask questions about personal sexuality, provide time for privacy, provide support for the spouse or significant other, suggest referral to a sex counselor or other appropriate professional? So go ahead and select your answer and go ahead and put your rationale. Um, and then you can pause and we're going to go ahead and resume. But when you look at this question, most appropriate intervention for concerns the client has. Um, encouraging him to ask questions about personal sexuality, provide time is time for privacy, not getting to the root of the issue. As far as providing support, what kind of support? D actually gets more specifically in an intervention that you can make a part of his plan of care and that suggesting to talk to an expert so he can voice his concerns and um, the, the counselor can help him in um, in, in coping and also to looking at other options. So again, you want to look at the rationale. Nurse Labs is a, a great resource that gives you questions as well as the correct and incorrect answers with rationales. Again, you can do this variety of questions. Make sure you're doing those, including those in your study plan. I'll talk to you guys soon. Um, as you know, I have resources on my X Etsy page, um, testing strategies, affirmations, study guides, as well as um, T-charts that I do recommend that you use to compare and contrast um, health conditions. I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care.